You're listening to the audio production of Nerves of Steel, Young Readers Edition, by Captain Tammy Jo Schultz, published by Thomas Nelson and read by Charity Spencer. Prologue. April 17th, 2018. New York's LaGuardia Airport is a bit tricky for airline pilots. LGA, as we call it, can be like quicksand, easy to get stuck in. Fortunately, today is not one of those days, and it looks like my first officer and I are going to escape the LGA trap without any worries. Our plane pushes back from the gate on time, and we taxi out to runway 31 and are cleared for takeoff without having to pause. It's first officer Darren Elliser's turn to fly. So I get us lined up and give him the controls. He pushes the throttles up, and we're off. The city quickly falls away below us. We point our nose southwest and settle in for a four-hour flight to Dallas Love Field in Texas. What a beautiful day to fly. But about 20 minutes into the flight, as we climb to 32,500 feet over eastern Pennsylvania, this beautiful day turns ugly. Boom! Something explodes like an artillery shell, and it feels like our plane has been hit. A quick look at the cockpit gauges tells me our left engine is dead— this isn't good, but it's manageable. I've been practicing single-engine failures in the flight simulator for 24 years. A fraction of a second later, not good, becomes not good at all. The jet, a Boeing 737-700, quickly rolls off to the left. The nose jerks hard and drops into a dive. Darren and I both lunge for the controls. Something more than an engine failure has happened. But what? Then a bone-jarring shudder runs through the aircraft. Chaos takes over. The air pressure plummets, and Darren and I can't breathe. Just as the air is sucked out of our lungs, the air conditioning system pulls gray smoke into the cockpit. A sharp 